これがレクイエン What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Show back with another video today. I'm actually curious. I want to know how you guys feel about this. Why do we not have more crossplay? Yeah, I'm giving me time to I'm giving you guys time to think. Okay, you don't know? I, I kind of know. I kind of have a theory at least. Obviously, that's not really much of a theory, but it's kind of like a hmm, I kind of understand where Sony's coming from. Sony was really blocking the crossplay thing for a while. Xbox was like, yeah, just go ahead and do it. Go ahead and give me crossplay. I, I don't mind. You know, Xbox was just kind of like, yeah. But I honestly think they didn't They didn't really want it to. For me, I understand that the risk of crossplay actually kind of hurts, like, PlayStation if it's moved in a certain way. Let me let me kind of get into that a little bit more. So when Ashley, when, when they were talking about crossplay, you know, cross-platform play, uh, which was really not even a thing until Warzone came into the picture. Warzone did it, and Call of Duty and Warzone and stuff, they've done it so effort, you know, I don't want to say effortlessly, because I didn't know how to say it, but uh, they've done it so clean, so smooth, everything is smooth. There might be, like, issues here and there. Um, no Man's Sky also has went to crossplay. There's a lot of games that can actually go crossplay. I just feel like, not necessarily they're too lazy to implement it, but... The one game I do want to get crossplay is Monster in the World. I have a lot of Xbox hunters out there. Um, I have a lot of people that are friends of mine that actually do hunts on Xbox and stuff. I understand that it's it's weird to actually make a Monster game, Monster Hunter game crossplay, but at the same time, out of any game that you make, Monster Hunter should be the game that definitely includes crossplay. And that's more to do with the company rather than the PlayStation. The only reason I say I understand why PlayStation would, would actually like no crossplay is mainly because okay, if you have this game. You know, you're playing on the Xbox, you're playing on the PlayStation, and the Xbox runs the game faster or runs the game better, and, you know, uh, you know, just just better in general, because the, the Xbox is a faster system. Then why would you play on PlayStation? You know, why would you get a PlayStation to play that game other than nostalgia and stuff and this, these fake console wars? I definitely can understand. I can understand their thought or process. Like, why would you play it on a weaker system when you can play with your friends on PlayStation? So it really don't matter. You can just play on a stronger system. I, I definitely get it. Other than that, though, I don't really see the need to kind of hold it back. I think with more PS5 entries, we'll see more crossplay. Hopefully, it doesn't phase out. Like, hopefully, hopefully it stays around like VR. But now, when VR first came out, I really care nothing about it. But now, it's you know blowing up everybody loves vr now everybody loves vr games vr movies and stuff everybody does so it's it pretty much changed the landscape of what was to become vr so i'm hoping like vr uh cross-platform play doesn't just kind of fizzle out i hope it stays strong and you know really they need to really just understand that this this causes so much opportunity for people to enjoy their platforms for me even if they include cross-platform play i'm not going to be scared to play an actual game on ps5 i'm still going to play it on ps5 um i'm just you know i'm a ps5 guy um for me it's all about exclusive i think that's the main thing when it comes to a console so if we have an exclusive that xbox can't run at a faster rate even with crossplay, you know because most of them are really single player games so it really doesn't matter i, I mean i feel like it should be it should be stated. We should have more crossplay in the future. Every game should come with some some thought of having multiplayer and having the cross platform. Honestly, it's it's a really big cluster mess, you know, because of the fact that you know um, trying to have everybody on one main server would cause it to be kind of problematic, you know, to have everyone cross crossplaying all handled by let's say at some point in time it's handled by Sony servers and stuff. I don't actually know how none of this stuff works. I'm just kind of taking a stab at the dark area and guessing. But for me, my final verdict is I would love to have more um, more cross-platform play. I would love to. Uh, I want to know, have you guys ever considered it? Do you want PlayStation and Xbox to actually work more together and include us in, in many different games and stuff, include cross-platform play? I do. I feel like it's it, at this point it's a necessary evil. Um, it's something that you definitely just kind of definitely want to play.
So, with that being said, guys, I'm going to pretty much wrap it up here. Um, I wanted to talk about this topic in specific because I really had moss on their mind. When I was discussing this topic with friends, we were all just kind of like, you know, we all play Warzone together. And Warzone is cool, but at the same time, you need a different game. Warzone is really booming because it has cross-platform play. And I've ta- not talked about Fortnite, but Fortnite also has cross-platform play. So, um, you know, but a lot of people, a lot of my circle of friends don't really play, like, Fortnite. So, they play Warzone. So, you know, I use Warzone as the main catalyst to say, hey, um, th- this is what I'm talking about. I've seen them do it so smoothly that I definitely think that games like Monster Hunter and stuff, where you don't have 100 people in a different map, could definitely pull it off really easily. It's really about whether they want to do it, whether they want to update the game for that. Uh, with that being said, guys, please like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next video.